It's time to set up your document camera. This box should have been delivered to your classroom. Very carefully, you're gonna open the top. Be careful of those staples that are in the box. And the first thing that you're gonna do is take out everything you need to set up this document camera. It's all in this top tray, remote, a book with the software in it, three cables in this section, the power. Once you get all those cords out, you're gonna carefully lift up this piece of styrofoam. Underneath is your actual document camera and the light. So we're gonna to need to take that out too. Just kind of fits down in there. I'll set it on the table, the light. And there's a little lens holder. So now your document camera is all unpacked. You've noticed I've already taken off the plastic that covered the document camera. And I've taken off the plastic that all of these things were wrapped in and discarded that. So I'm ready to just do the connection. The software should be on your computer, so that should be good. I'm gonna connect the power supply and these two pieces are, both pieces go together to form your power supply. So I'm gonna unwind this one, and untangle this. So this is gonna fit in here. Make sure that you get a good connection in there. It kind of snaps in, otherwise that power can come loose. The power will go in the back where it says DC 12 volt in and push that all the way in. And then of course this will plug into the wall. Then the only other connection that you need to do is take your USB connector and that goes right here on the right, on the right side in the back. The other side will go into your teacher computer in the back. So once you have those connected, your power, and to your computer. I'm gonna put the power supply down here. The only other thing we need to do is put the light on. So I'm gonna hook the light. And this light's movable, so if you find that this is not a good place for it, you can put it on that top bar also. There's one more cord here that we could use with this, and it's, it's a good cord to have, but we're not, we're, because we're hooking it through your computer so you can use it with your Promethean board, we're not using it at this time. So put that with things to save for later. Also, this little lens cap, we're not gonna, or lens case, we're not gonna use that right now. So that might be put with this stuff also. And there is a cap on your document camera itself, which you need to take that off to be able to show what's under it. Then the only other thing you need to do is open the back of your remote and put in the two batteries that are supplied. Those just snap in there. Put the back on. All you have to do now that the remote is ready to work, once it's all plugged in, is hit the power button. Take us a few seconds for your lamp to come on. and your document camera should be ready to use.